you to pull up here and we are looking at the brand new Honor 7X that was released in India some days ago. And you can see there's the hashtag this meaning full view and this meaning a dual camera. So this is the box. It might not be the retail box. I know at least it's the review box that we get. So when you open the box on top, you will get the phone here. We have the black model. We'll come back to the phone in just a bit. And when you go further inside, yeah, we'll get some other stuff like this where we get the brick it's a 10 watt charger and then you'll get a micro usb cable plus the sim tray ejector tool so that is a beautiful looking phone it's an all metal body but you can see it attracts lots and lots of fingerprints you can see those smudges here you can see smudges here as well so it will attract those uh, but it has this nice matte finish on the back i like that and then very noticeable camera bump over there from this side it actually looks a great deal like the honor 8 pro which is a good thing but nowhere matches the power of course so you have a 5.93 inch or almost 6 inch full hd plus display out here it's a full view display do not have the home buttons and then you have either your ps plus 8 mp front camera your dual uh, cameras here which honor called dual camera but one of them is only a depth sensor so only one camera sensor can take photos or videos LED flash and your fingerprint sensor over there nothing much here except the noise cancelling mic you have the power button volume rocker and then your dual hybrid sim card arrangement micro usb port 3.5 mm jack speakers and you also have your mouthpiece so that's about the uh, phone it's about 165 grams which is decent it's slightly longer so it's easier to hold plus only 7.6 mm of thickness so overall it makes for a very sexy looking phone so that is the full hd plus 6 inch screen i do not have the brightness uh, full i have it just about half but you can see how it looks in full brightness quite bright but uh, does not have a great like an excellent you know um, outdoor viewing the viewing angles are only about a decent i can check that out let's say in here in a color card uh, it recognizes the color palette difference is just about fine but not so much on the blue color they almost show the same but now you can see those the viewing angle it's only about average so a uh, decent display, full view display at this price point it's great but not so great a viewing angle. Now it's powered by EMUI 5.1, it has Android 7.x, uh, check that out, about phone you see, 7.0, 4GB of RAM, 64GB of internal storage, also comes with 4GB plus 32GB and it's actually 1080 by 2160 because of that extended uh, uh, extended resolution on that display you can go to memory and storage see out of 64 gb free about 44 because we have some of our games and all installed that will get more than that in the past one day average memory usage is 1.39 gb which is great we haven't used uh this continuously in like uh, you know very stressful manner but then uh, moderately usage uh will save you that much of gram which is a good thing they will get the typical google android apps plus many huawei uh, in-house apps like huawei health and high games and whatnot some of the tools here as well and then some games but i think you can go ahead and actually uninstall those which is very convenient if you do not like those free apps then go and uninstall yeah what else these are ours yeah so that's about the apps really that's the high board and long press here to go to some settings on the desktop and that's the notification bar and nothing comes up here the recent and go ahead and delete all back long press here to go to google assistant so the typical android stuff really so that's the dual camera setup but as i told you before you cannot use both the cameras because one is only a depth sensor but there's an extensive shooting mode here plus here you can go to pro pro photo video this one and whatnot yeah 
and he decide you have the settings this is 16 MP that's the primary camera and then you can automatically add watermarks and some of the other settings uh, this is cool you have the flash that's all right that is wide aperture mode where it will give a little blur the background basically that's a portrait it's a portrait mode that will automatically uh, show you the uh, beauty level you can increase or decrease the beauty level but when you press this and it's yellow then it also along with the portrait mode it also gives that bokeh mode to so this portrait plus on uh, the wide aperture mode you can call it so it will give the beauty mode plus it will also try to blur the background it's a nice touch you can also have some live picture or moving picture kind of thing that's the front camera it's an 8 mp front camera which is fine but uh, nothing much to write home about really but you have your screen flash on so guys you tested the image and video samples on this device they are great under enough light uh, they show decent amount of detail but when you zoom into 100% you'll see some noise even under uh, enough light they are definitely not the sharpest uh, photos in the market but they do greatly and specifically the depth sensor I see was quite accurate and can give you some great uh, you know portrait mode where your subject is kind of um, you know almost like coming out of the frame because it can blur the background almost 100% accurately actually in most times the front camera is only decent I wouldn't say it's it's great or it's excellent specifically under low light but under enough light you'll get some decent amount of um, selfies but remember that both of these cameras does not have stabilization so specifically under low light you'll have to be really steady to not get a blur picture It's a bit tricky, but I like the output. It's loud enough, actually. Let's check out the video and how it plays. Brilliant surround sound. Great natural vocal. I wish the wing angle was better so that a lot of people could watch this movie but overall the sound output is good and specifically the movie mode. The Kirin chipset mid-level chipset here is exactly like the one on the Honor 9i and it performs your day-to-day -day activities pretty flawlessly. You would not uh, feel so much of lag but when you have many apps on the background uh, then yeah you might uh, feel some lag out there we did some benchmark testing and the kirin chipset here performs about average so it scores around 62 and half thousand in antutu and then you can see a geekbench score 902 you have 3532 in geekbench multi-core score then 416 in 3d mark and um, you see 4886 in PC mark. This is a good score, but apart from that, all the other scores are just about average. The battery life is again average. It's not a great. It scores 3591. If that does not mean anything to you, uh, you can see it gave us round about seven hours of screen on time, which means that you'll be able to use this phone for most of the business day, but. If you use it moderately uh, throughout the day, you'll have to charge it again at night every day. Now the battery decline is good, of course it's a new battery so it's expected, but you see the decline is very uniform at no point of time the battery suddenly declines. So you can expect at any point of time how much time is going to be left and you'll almost be true about it because it won't decline suddenly. We played some demanding games like Asphalt 8 or Modern Combat 5 uh, and got fire uh, like those on this and it could play those perfectly, no sweat at all. So and guys, that was the brand new Honor 7X. 
at 13,000 it's a great proposition specifically if you like a full view display it has a full view display which is a good quality sharp display um, with an average viewing angle mind you the camera quality is again good it's above, above average but the depth sensor works really good the audio quality is good and i felt almost no lag at all time now uh, at 13,000, yeah i think this is really good and this is much better than honor 6x we'll have to try a lot to win a fight against some of the devices around 15 16k like some of the motorola devices or me a1 as such if you like this video please hit the like button ask anything related to this and we'll try to answer them all and please subscribe to our channel and share this video to share the life you can click on the icon there to subscribe to our channel and do not forget to hit the bell button to get notified whenever we publish new video thank you